Hi Joanne's fans! <laughs> it's a new uh, Thursday and uh, I know everybody so busy this period of the year and uh, I hope uh, you have a lot of customer so I don't want to teaching something like really really uh, uh, difficult things I want to show something how you can add uh, uh, small Christmas effect uh, color champagne so the theme today is champagne okay because it's so elegant and make uh, everything uh, more prettier and I will show how you do different kind of like a Christmas tree uh, effect I promise that is just simple the easiest design ever okay so you cannot mess it up and uh, the reason why I show something um, uh, really easy things because I already know how you are busy in the salon and just pretty sure you don't have right now time to practicing but always a uh, customer asking something Christmassy and the Christmas tree as a base as a background is always help to you even if you use sticker or stamping or whatever so that is make more Christmassy and I tell you if you uh, see that video promised exactly you can painting looks like ooh you are really really big experienced artist okay because I showed the easiest way and uh, you can do that what I will be using today of course the Picasso colors which is chocolate neon green and green those are the main colors what I mixing usually sometimes I add a black or white into do you remember the black and the white is not a color at all period so right now I'm just using the chocolate and the green the green to shade of the green and uh, I can add white and black to it that is just a little technical I just take it out from the the camera because it's just too too much things on my table and I will uh, using because I already know everybody buy <laughs> because that is the essential for uh, this year to the Christmas time I tell you is the biggest coolest things in uh, the 2021 uh, for sure in our industry why I telling that because uh, actually today uh, the European uh, star educator is received too and she just was so amazed it's like honey that is the best things in this year okay because it's like a full diamond but it's super super duper thin and full coverage come with the liner you can use the like ombre ink as I did and I will show you how you do and I will show if someone doesn't see yet just quickly how you can use on any other uh, different uh, uh, like effect doing different effects okay for example that kind of indigo super dark blue not that one the next one which is the 46 not that one one more time I just will find it honey I don't memorize for sure the colors and I just used that one mm -hmm. here we are okay for for example that is for New Year's and Christmas is just a big amazing uh, blue little bit uh, indigo okay I just want to show how coverage that is black okay and uh, because I will use on the white too if you're using already uh, blue or nude color make everything more easy right but the black is show up if is not full coverage so how I'm using if you want a thin line you can just simple rolling on the bottle inside touch the uh, the brush into the bottle okay and pull it pull it pull it pull it on the for direction to create thin line okay I just show because I think it makes sense but sometimes it's just uh, we just don't realize how easy uh, how you can take it off the excess so right now I will just do like whatever halfway or I just pull it like I see things look how coverage and they just pull it on the surface pull it pull it pull it like angled 
way or yeah and from here it's smaller because it's like icy ombre version I will do different ombre and I will show I just tell you how that is you can do immediately something sparkly and a unique effect just like that you don't see really well because it's matte on the back but I will put into the lamp and I will cover it with top shine so you will see how it looks like exactly so she's back I will be using right now the champagne because I just picked the color okay you love the whole collection <laughs> I love it too honey I just I just realized this I'm so sorry when I was really busy in the salon and no one make product like Joanne's do because that is just make super easy. Do you remember just simple for using painting smile line, right? Or the champagne smile line. I'm using that color too today. It's just good for everything because it's like doesn't raise up, uh, cure through beautifully. It's make easy, even if uh, design, even if you do like French, okay? So let's use the champagne is the, ooh, no, the 48 is the green. So the 49, 049 is the, like a champagne color, or you can call it uh, 18K gold. Okay, I just love because I love the more sophisticated gold. But if customer want a more rich gold, just use the rich gold. Or more natural or more rose gold is depending what you want. I just using champagne today and the weekend I will do silvery and I show you guys super cool things. Again, it's super easy design. Okay, so I will pull it quickly and I do show how you do on long nails if you want that kind of effect. And you will see how full coverage okay right now it's where is the cuticle area it's a little bit thick okay i don't left this quantity around the cuticle area okay i will do pulling 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 down okay because it's not necessary to be thick it's beautiful coverage super rich and super fine at the same time because uh, glittery things is if super fine i'm pretty sure you realize is don't really bright anymore because is they just cut to the particle which is not brightening however that is not glitter again girls that is not glitter and super fine so that can be super uh, thin application with full coverage okay i don't want to pull it too much because again i want to do like um, like ombreing with the white so i'm using the ombre brush <coughs> And I just met like touching touching you don't have to do beautiful perfect ombre I won't have no uh, plain white here so I have to blending to make like uh, kind of ombre or the color is uh, is start uh, mm, fusioning you know what I mean so is I don't want to see the line that I mean exactly okay so you pull it pull it down till you don't see the line anymore right it's just a teeny tiny that 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 kind of like that okay i put it into the lamp and i add on this the top shine so you will see how it looks like simply just doing uh, using us like uh, effect in the background or just simple color if the customer doesn't want to extra nail art okay or you're just using a stamp it or you're using sticker just simple doing a background it's just so amazing right okay that is just a tip how you can use because uh, <coughs> you don't have to use only for create a simple line or any kind of design how is your day guys i tell you here in long beach california have a rainy day and cloudy day and 
a little bit crazy day so i was so happy to come home because i see on the street everybody is like so frustrated and uh, they just rush and they i don't know i was happy to parking in the garage and go home and create something uh, champagne -y, nice uh, design to you guys I don't know whether I have a cold or not. I think we got too quickly the uh, the cold and the people doesn't was prepped for that and everybody started being like crazy. <laughs> so in Vegas too, windy and cloudy. Yeah, I think is is uh, we are almost the same area. So but I hope you guys have really amazing day and uh, uh, the people I know a lot of customer coming and you do the nail uh, just don't over stressed and don't let them to to make frustrated okay so you are in charge you don't sell oxygen okay so doesn't have to it's a luxury thing and let them respect your job and uh, because you deserve that okay so make sure to keep calm because mostly we going to the Christmas event like super tired our hair is doesn't down nail doesn't down and the nervous system is already over <laughs> overwhelmed so please take care of yourself and if the customer frustrated just try to change her energy and tell is like and that's okay everything will be all right or something you know just don't pick up the, their stress so what I'm using I'm using quickly the builder uh, milky white okay which is uh, a pretty white but same time is see-through too and I I'm able to using a thin layer because I don't want encapsulating at all that is just so good to make uh, this kind of ombre up pulling out and hide it a little bit the the glittery part because I don't want to see where is uh, the white and where is the yellowish things, right? So here already, not so much material at all. So I just touch it and I just pull, 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 pull. Even if you feel it doesn't come in nothing, I tell you, it's coming and makes super smooth uh, ombre. Okie dokie. Just like that, right? And I'm pretty sure you already thinking is okay, honey, but that is long nails. What about the shorties? And I'm the sister who always sh uh, show the short version too, because some customer have long nail, some customer have a short nail. So I'm doing the short with different design, okay? But the system will be same, the method. Okay. Again, the cuticle area, I pull it a little bit thicker look at how easy to create smile line or rounded rounded design look just simply that honey that before he was not able to do okay because it was raised up or was not sharp in the line because glitter that is not a glitter so you are able to do drawing nice sharp uh, line okay right now i don't do that <laughs> i just because I just made and I want to show how as example we can use on so many way so many way that product so that is your best friend that collection I tell ya so I just pull it pull it pull it because I want less quantity at all and I don't want because it's shorty okay I don't want cover it the whole surface with the glittery things right so i just touch it and a little bit i pull it not so much i just pull it pull it and i bring down because i want like a white and the sparkly uh, champagne color make a fusion and make a cute good effect as a background Okay, okay. Okay, I put it into the. Hold on, I just missed one spot. You know, it's happening the customer too when she wanna leave her hand, and you just give me back, give me back, right? 
actually with me happened a lot especially if i'm busy and i work uh, eight ten hour a day because it was christmas time right <coughs> now the next one <coughs> sorry i do quickly that one too so uh, we can go ahead and just do nail art after that right you guys have any question so far because right now i i, I will be able to see I just drawing quickly actually it doesn't have to be pretty but I cannot do not pretty with this brush the key is the material is not pretty is not glitter and the second the brush what we using is super soft and developed exactly for linering if you have any kind of liner and you cannot drawing nice uh, smile line like I did it's because the brush for sure and if shrinking or doesn't sharp the the smile line that means the material okay but honey honestly that is again I think the 2020 biggest things unfortunately I just come out end of the year <laughs> because I try to you know like seasonal thinking every time something new to you guys i tell you i already making the 2022 mm -hmm. so i already know what coming for the spring and the summer and the winter always i do uh, because i'm i developing i don't buying the gels okay so i need time to testing to to mixing the best color effect whatever so I just tell you, I usually one year ahead, I make everything. This is why we don't have out of stock, okay? Because we don't waiting to the China cargo coming in the waiting in the port, right? So, and a lot of uh, nail sister asking and interesting how we doing. And this is why I want to share some uh, information how we operate or how we doing actually we can be able to do anything what we want so maybe i will do show you guys more of that not today but once one day so i can show behind of course the manufacturer area is not open for the public as period first of all the tricks is uh, secret second is the insurance because we are in the heavy manufacturing uh, area okay so by this reason it's just impossible but i will figure it out somehow how i can share with you guys because there's so much cool things so okay i just did quickly like kind of ombre -ing. and if you did a great job like i did you don't even need to use the ombre brush because because i told you uh, the builder milky white if you're using just a thin layer is really working beautifully okay so how is the salon everybody is busy crazy busy or just right now it's just perfect it's nice it's busy i don't know you guys but sometimes i got super busy and i i don't even realize how many customer uh, want to do the nail and i just overload that and after honestly i just lay down under the christmas tree and uh, this is why i want to tell you be smart and if someone asking the deposit for sure period okay if someone doesn't respect don't need christmas nail okay because you know they have to respect you and uh, you don't have to working like crazy you have to charging well to don't work crazy right so let's painting together or i painting and i show i promised the word easiest christmas tree design how you make it so i will using my perfect line brush of course If you have a current problem with Picasso, that means you're using thick. Again, the Picasso is not a painting gel, 
okay the picasso is an art gel uh, made for super thin painting okay if it doesn't cure because mine is all cure and you know that mean uh, uh, you applied too thick okay <clears throat> You are not overloaded. That is okay. I don't want you become overloaded. It's good quantity of the customer, and don't uh, make too much uh, uh, stress and too much working because I, I, I just don't wish that. Period. It's just you will be tired, and you deserve the nice, calm Christmas too. Especially if you have your own, um, uh, yeah, you know, you cooking and you do everything in your home. That is just really, really difficult, honey. And people, even you don't even realize, okay? Right now I'm using the chocolate and I mix chocolate green and uh, uh, the neon already pre-mixed. And look, this is how I'm using. So if you pull it, and have gel on the brush now that is not for picasso that is gel polish quantity so i look how i pull it pull it pull it like this i'm using just almost nothing of the gel this is how super intensive the the gel hmm? so uh, which direction which direction that will be from okay from here whatever so one is for coming like this no worry I will I will this line work uh, messed up for a reason okay so doesn't have to be nice that is a nice of that I told you doesn't have to be pretty or nice okay and right now I touching the oh where is my glass is my glass you see it's really new to me and I always I forget it <laughs> not just because I don't see well biggest problem the reflection so if you don't see well the lines especially on the shiny surface please go to the optometrist because they realized how yes I doesn't see the the something if have a reflection so touch the center line what I draw and just pull it pull it pull it honey it doesn't have to be proper doesn't have if you go out that's okay too okay because I will painting on the whole uh, greeny things did I use the top shine on that quicker whatever sometimes I do uh, halfway cure top shine to make uh, evening the surface so next one touch the center and just pull it pull it pull it pull it pull it mm -hmm. I will use on the short is the quickly something transparent to make sure it doesn't make uh, just will be more easier on this design doesn't really matter I tell ya, because I will over painting on the the brown So you are never late. I just uh, showing how you painting super easy and how really you don't have to stress out the line work because this kind of uh, uh, Christmas tree design doesn't matter how you pull it the the line, especially the brown. If I don't use uh, layering the colors, you have to make sure it's proper, right? But on this, it's just let will be the background and i just don't want homogeneous background okay and i pull it this direction too just because make more homogeneous or balanced actually okay no matter how you just like kind of the christmas tree but if you go outside uh, to the center or something that's okay because I will hide it I just need this brownish background 
Okay. Mm. Pull it, pull it, pull it. I just do a little bit curving here because it's long enough that uh, uh, tips. So what I'm doing right now and what I mentioned before, or you can use, uh, for example, the Builder Clear, super thin layer, or you can use the Top Shine, but do not make fully cure. Just 15 seconds or 20 seconds, okay? I'm using right now uh, a thin layer of the Builder Clear. Just like that. And I put it back to cure them because it makes more easy drawing on. So, please use a thin layer, okay? It doesn't have nothing to encapsulating. I just need to make smooth and the builder clear make smoothening out. Mm -hmm. And I do totally same as I, as I did. And on this is more uh, easy to pull it. You see that right now? It doesn't have to be nice. That is again background. Okay. I just showing and teach you how you layering the Christmas tree, and this way will be stress free, because at the end it will be looks like a nice kiss Christmas tree. Okay. At the center is more brownish, and uh, how I pull it out is more light. Okay, don't forget it, don't over designing because it's shorty. Okay, just a little bit. Yeah. Mm. Okay. <coughs> and on this one too. She come from here. Center and I just start following the center line and pull it, pull it like hair, like little hairy things. If you don't pull enough, because I told you I don't pick up gel at all. Okay. You can pick up more. Better if multiple time you do than you pick up too much and uh, will be difficult to cure. Okay. That is, you have to make quick on both hand because that is not something uh, 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 difficult and uh, you can do, actually I think it's like couple minutes design, okay? Like that, not more, okay, because it's shorty. Next, I don't even, uh, or you can do just like wipe it, okay, don't need to wash. So the next will be the greeny, okay, a little bit darker. And I do same from the center line just pull it randomly don't have to be perfect don't have to following if you go out to from the center line that's okay too because will be not visible I don't painting on the brown I randomly really randomly I just touch down and pull it pull it okay that is the key and this is why it will be so natural and uh, really a salon design okay so it's time uh, wise too because have some you know like santa claus face and it's cute but honey no one will sitting till you painting santa 
maybe if sticker so sometimes i just tell it like you know what buy the sticker is just more easier but the christmas tree is really not a difficult things you will do make it successfully and the customer will like amaze like oh my god you are artist yes you are so i just you see i just pulling pulling totally same motion what i did on the with the brown just i'm using right now the green i mix the green with the brown too i tie up because i like uh, darker to the christmas tree and a little bit continue to here just because i can a little bit here Mm -hmm. and pull it pull it you see i don't even uh, uh, stressed out how i pulling and how was originally to the shape right now i curving up you see i just changed the direction that was this way right now i painting this way okay that is the super super duper cool of that because at the end will be really a rea realistic christmas tree branch but uh, you cannot mess up <laughs> that is the key okay this cute teeny tiny things too right make sure i cover it the the brown you may be thinking oh the brown is not necessary honey the brown is necessary because somehow will visible somewhere and this is why it looks like dimensional and really realistic if you're just drawing with the simple the the green it will be not really realistic you see i just create new part of like a teeny tiny one You know, sometimes have like this, and I pull it, pull it. You see, and sometimes I touch the other part, which is normally a problem. On this kind of design, what I'm doing, the layering one, is doesn't matter because at the end will be not visible at all. another one to here too mm -hmm. go into the lamp and when you're doing you do one finger go into the lamp and till drying you are working on the other hand right to save time now that will be more smaller okay just pull it pull it that mean I make sure not overloaded the brush and you pull it short doesn't pull it long because i need shorty uh, hair or you know the little needle leaf the leafy things even if it's thin please do the both side pull it pull it pull it pull it pull it pull it just like that so easy because uh, because no rules no regulation and after if you want to change for example curving more down you can continue easily just go back pull it pull it pull it pull it pull it Sorry, my little babies, uh, super active, <laughs> as always. So if you hear the little barking, 
she she want to protect me i don't know from what but she sometimes she hears something and uh, she want she barking and she want protect me okay so you can curving on different di uh, direction too this is why so easy because when you create it like mm, you know what i want a little bit more longer or and i tell you if you make a grinch hand you know when pulling the the little things that is same method how i do the grinch hand okay and the third one to make dimension you love my babies when barking <laughs> yeah she they are so happy happy babies so i'm using right now the lighter which is mixed with neon and white and right now I do the opposite uh, way so I pull it from here from outside to inside at that point please try to doesn't go really cross of the halfway if not if you can control if you go it you can go back to the dark green and cover it you see has started being realistic because that gives the dimension to them I just touch it touch it touch little hairy things and honestly you cannot mess that up if it's too much of the light you can again go back with the dark green I don't put everywhere because the youngest uh, part of the leaf is more yellowish, right? But it's just me. If you do whole, that's okay too. I just like a little bit playing with the, the dimensions. Okie dokie. Mm -hmm. Isn't it realistic already? It is good I do, did the different shape because you can see uh, it's how many way you can do. And even if shorty, even if long nails, you can you can drawing on. And really, really honestly, is not necessary any big artistic experience. Because I just use it, you have to be used a super uh, uh, thin and super uh, soft brush, okay? That for sure. But anything else is just pull it, pull it, touch down and pull it, pull it. Make sure you don't pick up too much. Sometimes I pick up not enough, so you, I'm able to pick up again. But if already have... Uh, on the brush too much and you touch down is just not good okay so pick up multiple time for less it's just better mm. like that i don't know how you are i'm really waiting this year i'm really not a grinch Mostly I'm super tired and I just, you know what, I, I just want to lay down. But right now I'm really, really waiting the Christmas. Not because a, a gift, okay? Because the, the warm in the house, just stay home, you know, like pyjama party, good foods. It's just, I think I deserve that. And I really, really own the mood. I know it's long, far away from now. I just doing Christmas design because I want to help you guys inspiration maybe tomorrow the next customer wants something Christmassy Christmas tree okay so that is a good uh, chance to learn the last time last minute sorry not last time at the last minute things so and I really really I, I'm already made uh, the plan what I will cooking because I'm I'm big baker cooker I tell ya. So I already know the menu. 
and this year is just usually the my friend tell me or the family is you are a grinch <laughs> because i just you know i just i'm not really the christmas person but this year this way will be amazing okay so here we are i will do hungarian traditional uh, christmas food for sure uh which is oh honey if you go to hungarian house they will feed you all the time you know so it's like six curse of the menu <laughs> And after two days, you are not able to walk in, right? <laughs> We're just watching the TV. So I will do Hungarian food and baking Hungarian um, like cookies. Uh, and for sure, I will do the duck again because I love it. So go back to the Christmas tree. So what else I will do? Again, I'm using quickly the Builder Cleo, a thin layer. Oh, you know what? You can use just simple. Ah, yeah. I use just simple. No, I'm using the Builder Clear Thin. Mm -hmm. But you guys can uh, let me know inspiration because always I open something new. Just make sure I cook enough because I, I don't want everybody hungry at Christmas. <laughs> you know, everything about food and Christmas uh, movies and Christmas music and just laying down and relax and enjoy the company, uh, the loved ones, the babies, even if two leg or four leg or just three or whatever, more than four leg is too much to me so spider is cannot playing okay so what i will using i will use the teal and gold the sp6 of the glitters okay which is like the golden uh it's million version of if you see million version of the glitters round hexagonal teeny tiny microscopic line and this is included the little like super super uh shiny and super flat actually that is the key uh super flat uh round version of the the glitters look at that and super flat that is important that is not metal mm-hmm I think I pull it more down. Yeah. Yes, like that. I don't even able to cook small portion, honey. <laughs> you are not alone. I cooking overcooking, you know, usually one week uh, everybody eating same because I cook too much because I don't want how someone is hungry, right? And doesn't got enough usually not a problem open the fridge and do it yourself but Christmas Christmas have to be special so everybody just sitting I serving the food and just enjoy the time together okay and I'm using right now the little good lace that is metal okay and I want to show how cute it is. I don't know which tip I will be using for that. Actually, I just seeing. Where is the other? Oh, here we are. But you know what? I think I'm using on this one. Mm -hmm. Press it in. Make sure it's not bumping out it's flat and it's straight okay 
a mm, little bit more down because I need uh-huh like this go into the lamp and this one is just coming quickly like here and like here mm. like here because it's more so she's back and right now I will use again the teeny tiny brush and from the greenish because I don't want too dark right for the greenish brown I will pulling like a line mm -hmm. just as long as the space is needed Need a little bit darker, like this. Mm -hmm. That is will be a shadow of the line, I tell ya. Mm -hmm. And here too. Go back to the lamp. Isn't it so easy? So I just add quickly. Now that I'm using the builder clear for sure because I want kind of encapsulating. I hope it's cured the brown because I, I take that quickly. I just check the timer. <laughs> And always, I promise, I don't do too long. But you know me, I'm just talking and show and one more tips and one more tips. Because just different alternatives. And I want to show how no matter which shape or length or which kind of design the customer want it, you can do a Christmas tree with every kind of design. Even if you use stickers or building in something like metal like I did or just using stamping so here we are I add the top shine on that mm. no one more things no yes are you with me so top shine all night <laughs> I really thinking I want to go to like uh, the snowy place when you know you can renting the house and oh that is doesn't cured i think i just place it on without any top shine so right now we are cure into the top shine mm -hmm. go in and there is snow and we can cooking and we can talking and we can do nail art it's just like a weekend the getaway right you got got the snow already oh my god you you know how missing to me the snow it's like eight years already i don't see snow just when they coming uh, the shaving the ice right with lemonade so just that one or when i cleaning in my freezer <laughs> <laughs> and I really love the snow I'm a northern girl for sure okay I'm using the top shine again do not fully cure the top shine 30 seconds yeah I just thinking need the nail sister get away is <laughs> something you know when everybody can be like not in pyjama but you know relaxed and just eat and do nail art and eat again and nail art and we we realized how successful we are after can be warming up at night something you know so she's out and she will what i touched i messed up in the light whatever yeah she's out and they're using the matte top coat you see the freezer you can get ice from the freezer <laughs> for sure 
I am using the matte top coat on. This is the point when I usually mess up the nail art because I check the hour or you check the customer when coming, the next one. And uh, sometimes just better slow down. Top shine. Okay. And I'm using the teeny tiny Japanese studs that is the 003. And that teeny tiny can stay stable on the, the design even if just you put into the top shine. Going to the lamp, mm. Ooh, the two magnet is connected and this is how I messed up. Right now I realized I put them too close each other and the magnet is just jumping on each other. So I using the mat on this one too. Oh, you know what? Oh, yeah, I use it. No, whatever. Yeah. Mat. Because I really love this champagne color and this effect with the matte. You will see. It's just so cool. And here is the matte. Quickly I'm using the black elastic gel. And please make sure it's super thinny tiny lines, okay? Do not make too wide or too thick and that is too thin whatever good and here's just one like half okay one more longer this way okay Go into the lamp because the champagne is super light and if you used on a mat uh, the black will be really impressing on the surface just if super thin okay ha must have super thin and one more things what I will using is the glue gel pen And then using the little head to add shining again. I had a bubble already. So I'm circling. <coughs> Sorry, it's cold. I squeeze out and I just make sure it's covered the whole things. It looks like a Swarovski brighting like really deadly because that is not a, a, a simple yellow glitter. Actually I, this uh, glitter mix we have a pink which is matte pink and beautiful and gold. Okay, flesh curing because I will continue and that part too. This is good too, just the center, okay? But I make circling to make like a gold bubble or the little dome. Mm -hmm. I can't wait this Saturday. I will show the new new crazy things but I've, I really love it especially Christmas it's the last minute is really good okay flash and she's back and of course she need 
extra that 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 so uh, no, that is glue gel pen. It's cured to shiny, super shiny, and fix the Swarovski and anything on. Well, it's not a builder gel. You don't have to wipe it at all and keep any kind of Swarovski or metal tools, uh, metal uh, studs, or this kind of teeny tiny things securely on the top. And I'm using if I want. Uh, to be shiny something like I did right now with the glitter mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I just put it back flash cure those are uh, pretty enough just a flash cure okay don't over stress it. And of course some here too, just randomly. Teeny tiny or bigger size, we have four sizes. I tell you it's better if you used multiple size because it's more, the more variety make more unique. Mm -hmm. Right now I'm just lazy and I open it only that one. But of course, because I I have a microphone on and I don't want to uh, take off to go grab my stuff. Okay, so please forget it. Forgive me. <laughs> But I tell you that what I'm doing, the little dots, if different sizes, it will be more cooler. <coughs> so, one more here. Do you guys have any question till I cure the gel? So that is not a builder gel. That is uh, a little bit fluidy, actually. But... Uh, do this nice C curve when I do uh, dropping all out one drop and to create the beautiful dome okay and I place on the teeny tiny things what I want uh, adding on you just I think is a must-have things again uh, even if you see uh, someone using that that is just a jar okay the gel is we filled and we made to them to make more secure the metal because I, I really love the little metal things because everything may are, make a simple things uh, make looks more prettier with and we have really large variety of Japanese stats and uh, I developed the gel for this reason and the Swarovski glue gel pen you can find at joins.com we have only the joins.com uh, site and exclusively and the, we called glue gel pen okay so here we are uh, mud or shiny or small or from left or from la right use the the retro uh, elastic uh, gel or you don't use little metal uh, uh, lace i think is really good and i have a lot of this kind of design which is good for all season, but uh, Christmas especially, I think is really cool. And that kind of blingy blingy, which is looks like a mirror, gold mirror underneath, that is have in the special series of the glitter, SP6, number six, that is the tail. I tell you for summer is a must have too. And I have the pink, honey, the pink is just must have. Matte, matte, white, pink and gold or matte uh, teal 
white and gold and if you see have million version cutting million size round hexagon teeny tiny uh, four ratings is just super good super good okay so this is how we looks like super easy don't forget it i tell you don't stress out the christmas tree because it will be not visible as detail but generally you can do different kind of design or background or even if you use uh, i have beautiful uh, christmas stickers too i tell you gold and any kind of but just the quality one okay if you uh, uh, stressed out how someone will asking something special or will be no time because she is always late just grab some cool one and uh, for example the rose gold deer is just amazing it's just amazing okay so i hope you love it i hope you will uh, use that in this uh, crazy uh, christmas uh, period and i hope you are busy don't forget it don't stress out okay and uh, i will come out uh, this weekend saturday with silvery colors of kind of christmas but i show you something new i will launching out super cool stuff for new years or christmas or all year seasons okay i love you guys don't forget it love each other and uh, take care of yourself ciao